Hi, I'm Matthew Ashy and welcome to Blackwell Global's Daily Market Update. Starting with the Euro and the pair went back into freefall despite a number of solid PMI results out of the Eurozone. The plunge back to the 1.0529 mark was predominantly caused by Harker's remarks that he would be open to rate hikes in March. However, a bearish technical bias also added to the selling pressure quite significantly. Looking ahead, the EU CPI results will now be in focus. Turn to the Swissie now and the pair surged higher despite a buoyant trade balance of $4.73 billion. The move reflected the broader market trend which saw sentiment return to the US dollar as market participants continue to price in near-term rate hikes from the Fed. Moving forward, eyes will now be on the Swiss UBS consumption indicator which is due out shortly and could help to cap gains. Finally, the Kiwi dollar was slammed lower during the session and sank as low as the 0 spot 71.29 mark. However, the New Zealand dollar did pull back to close only moderately lower at the 0 spot 71.61 level as the 100 day moving average provided some support. These losses were sparked by Harker's remarks and a 3.2% drop in the GDT price index. As for the coming session, monitor the New Zealand credit card spending data closely. Well, that's all I have for you today. So, Matthew Ashley with Blackwell Global's Daily Market Update.